As the nation struggles to reduce the number of illegal firearms and ammunition in the country, the analysis of the firearm offenses for the 2024 January through to October crime statistics report shows a consistent rise in offenses linked to firearms. Acting Sergeant 372 Movin Robinson of the Central Investigations Unit within the Royal Signature Police Force provided an overall summary of the report with the Central Division recording the highest number of offenses once more. The number of accepted firearm offenses in increased by 49% from 191 in 2023 to 284 in 2024. Similarly, detected firearm offenses rose by 76% from 122 in 2023 to 215 in 2024. The Northern Division recorded 61 firearm offenses, while the Southern Division recorded 74 offenses and the Central Division had the highest with 149 offenses. Recovery efforts for the period under review saw a decrease in the number of firearms recovered. 72 illegal firearms were recovered during the numerous law enforcement operations conducted. Of those 72 firearms, they included 56 pistols, 6 shotguns, and 5 rifles. Other recoveries included two revolvers, two imitation firearms, and one air pistol. The majority of recovered accessory and component parts were 53 regular magazines, followed by four extended magazines, three selector switches, and three auto sales, with one firing pin indicating that the magazines and the selector switches and the auto cells revealed components found that were will, that will able to transform firearms or modify firearms from semi-automatic to fully automatic. Nevertheless, the Royal Signature Police Force continued to make strides in the efforts in ammunition recovery as well. A total of 1,318 lethal rounds of ammunition were recovered with the highest number being 9mm rounds, which accounted for 742, making up 56% of the total. Other notable calibers were the .40 caliber for 196 rounds, the 5.56 caliber for 181 rounds, and the .380 caliber for 104 rounds. Additionally, there were 48 non-live rounds or shell casings that were recovered, and there were a total of Less lethal rounds, pellets of 12,040, which were also recovered. The use of firearms as the weapon of choice increased significantly over the last four years, jumping from 34 in 2020 to 54 in 2024, with a record high of 59 instances in 2023. Gun and gang-related crime has been a major contribution to the rising homicide rate in St. Lucia. Over the last few months, the Royal St. Lucia Police Force has conducted a series of joint operations, seizing illegal firearms and ammunition, and arresting more than a dozen people in the effort to take away the guns that lead to homicides. For Choice News Now, I am Chelsea Austin reporting.